mountain. Cold. Crisp. Devoid of life. Other adjectives that you could use to describe the mountain would help paint a picture of this lonely and desolate place. Far north of any other community, civilization, world, the mountain exists like a peaceful giant waiting to destroy civilization. The mist is deep, dark, and surrounds the mountain tops. The mist is the coldest of them all. Come, come on, come off it, Rob. I mean, I, yeah, we're searching some weird green glow, but I, it's not like this is some like Star Trek thing, all right? Why, why are you on this Star Trek kick? But Mr. Pond, I just thought that our whole situation seemed more like a Star Trek vibe, adventurous. You know, you know, you know that I'm I'm more of a, a Star Wars guy anyway. You know. Yes, I, I know you prefer Star Wars, Brandon, but uh, I think we all know Mr. James T. Kirk would never sell out like that. Yeah, yeah, James T. Kirk wasn't quite the uh, sellout mercenary that Han Solo was. Well, but how much farther is it? Well, the ruins are just up ahead there. I think that's where we saw the green glow. So let's keep going, shall we? Yeah, all right. Let's go. Rob? You, um... Are you planning on inviting anybody to the, uh... the dance? You mean the big summer rolling on the river ball? Yeah. See, I was... I was kind of thinking about asking Rachel Come on, Brandon. Rachel's the most popular girl in the school. We all know you don't have the balls for that. Brandon! 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 Come help me! The wolves are coming! Rachel! Help me! Brandon, untie me! Quick! Help me! Um, I'll see you at school! I just don't know how to use them. Yeah, that was pretty crummy. I, you know, I know I've got the balls. I just, I just need the right opportunity to show them off. To just show everybody that I've got the balls. Well, balls are an interesting thing, Brandon, because... Look, 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 look! The ruins. The ruins! Oh man, I'm so happy because I was getting pretty tired. Yeah. Oh. Holy hopping hippo cheeks! Look at look, look at that! Some kind of metal metal capsule. Is it alive? No, it's it's made of metal, Brandon. Hmm. Now it seems to me. Yes. 
Interestingly, I'm getting a small amount of alpha radiation off of the object. You know what that means? The half-life hasn't decayed! That's right. There's an active power source. Now, by my calculations... 1, 2, 3, 3, 4, 11, 5... Uh, that should be... Yes. 562 years. What? This object has been sitting on the ground here for over 562 years. How... How is that possible? How is it still emitting power? Well, it's not. Not by contemporary standards, anyway. It's impossible for any element on Earth to last 562 years and still emit power. That means... Yes. That means this little beauty here isn't from Earth. This is insane! A machine emitting power for over half a millennia? I've got so many questions. I mean, what does it do? Where's it from? <laughs> well, I can answer one of those. Where does it come from? It comes from Alpha Centauri. How did you find that out? Did, it, did you negatively charge the ions and replot the path backwards to the coordinates of its origin? No, I just read the label there. Made in Alpha Centauri. Amazing. As for your question on what it does, well, there might be a possibility. Yes. Just a pi, one, two, three, logarithm. What's the square root of 913,000? 955.51033, give or take. Why? Yes. Yes, excellent. Good, good, good. Now, that means, yes, I can probably charge the front power sector by reversing the energy outflow of my power probing unit, effectively recharging the cell. Sort of like connecting jumper cables between two cars. Yes, that, that should do it. Now, hopefully it remains stable. What do you mean? Uh, this power source is an unknown potential. And if we do the wrong thing, well, it could cause an explosion which would rip the very fabric of the space-time continuum, effectively ending all life as we know it. And what happens if it works? I don't know. Stuff? Well, nothing ventured, nothing gained, right? I mean, I've been looking for the opportunity to show off my balls and this might just be it.